Hey guys, I'm Z here and welcome back to a new gameplay on GTX 1650 Open, the i5-3470. Today I'm going to be testing FIFA 22 at 1080p ultra quality settings. I don't see any point in testing the other quality settings because sadly this CPU is already bottlenecking the GPU on ultra. Nonetheless, the performance is really great and the game runs fine with no problems, although I do recommend locking the FPS at 60 so you won't get some FPS drops and such rain. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, please subscribe for more, and take care. Pulses racing, it's Paris Saint-Germain facing Real Madrid. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And now here's Aidan Azar. He's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Over it comes. And the keeper will happily collect that one. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Sergio Ramos in central defence. Neymar starts. And there the move will end because it's offside. Close though. An exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stuart, what are you expecting to see from Mbappe? Well, Derek, he's playing well at the moment. He's confident. He's making runs in behind. He always looks a threat when he gets on the ball. He's been good with the ball at his feet. And when crosses come... Oh, into opportunity the... here, Stuart. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out any sign of danger. Can he put them in front? Oh, no. He's missed the opportunity. And they remain level. Well, he just lacked composure there, didn't he? They should be ahead now. Modric. Now with Benzema. Opportunity in the wide area. But they dealt with the threat posed. Intelligent threaded pass here. And it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Action underway once more. A wake-up call for the Real players, maybe. Can they find a response now? A chance, maybe, from the wide position. Making sure it didn't get past him. Hakimi... Breaking at pace. That's how to rob them of possession. Marquinhos. Our possession is the watchword inside their own territory. And there it is, a chance. And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Well, as you can see here, it all starts with a perfectly weighted ball in behind the defenders. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. So, 2-0 now. Effective challenge. Well, as the stats confirm, PSG have had the lion's share of possession. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here, and it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. And a chance here, Hakimi! 
And up for grabs off the keeper. Still a chance. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, what a brilliant save that was. I can't... Oh, Stewart, they might be onto something. It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick. And can they exploit the space out wide? And they deal with the threat this time. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. Tremendous block. And that is that for the first half here in the French capital. So into the second half, and you can't really put it any other way. A huge gulf in quality between the sides and the first 45. Will we see a response from Real? Mbappe. Gay. Messi. That's high-level goalkeeping. Well, that's a fantastic save. He's such a good keeper. And a bad touch like that usually will mean giving the ball away. And Neymar towards Messi, far post, and he's clear his lines. Benzema, and the counter-attack is on, options available. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Really good interception. Now, let's see what they can do here. Oh, he's given it. The referee says penalty. And an opportunity for them to pull one back here. Well, no card handed out. He gets away with a rebuke. Well, a lot of referees would have booked him there. But I'm with him on this one. No yellow card for me. A goal it is! A confidently taken penalty! Well, here we can see it again, and he's done well to read the intentions, but just can't get a touch on it as it sails over him. So close to being a fantastic stop. Well, 2-1 it is here. Gareth Bale. Regained possession. Half a, and the alarm bells are ringing. Oh, surely. Brilliant save. A wilting under the pressure. And now they try to go forward. And the poor touch didn't help them on the possession front. Benzema. Aiden Azar. Can they create something from here? Casemiro. Nicely timed tackle. Wijnaldum. Will it be Wijnaldum? Oh, it's an unbelievable save by Courtois. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. It's Neymar's corner. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here.
Well, here's the replay, and he just strikes the ball down the middle. The goalkeeper gets out of the way. It's a really good penalty, and no danger that the goalkeeper was going to save that. So there it is, 3-1, the current scoreline here. How about the cross? Insufficient guile on the crossing front, you've got to say. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Mbappe. Neymar waiting to pounce. Well, nothing wrong with the header, but it was always going that little bit off target. Well, not far away from the final whistle, and PSG very much in control. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play, and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. <laughs> Substitution for Real Madrid. <laughs> Marcelo, happy to take on the shot. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Corner kick played in. Thumps clear. Bale. An awful lot of green space to run into. Well, no pressure on the keeper. Poor cross. Taking care of business defensively here. Could be a chance to break here. And Neymar. Ronaldo. And the assistant referee has raised his flag. Offside. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Karim Benzema. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Benzema. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Benzema. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. And there's the final whistle, and we can confirm a victory for Paris Saint-Germain. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Well, you know, I think Kylian Mbappe enjoyed himself. Your verdict on his performance tonight? Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?